hi guys welcome welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is emily if you are a returning subscriber you're a friend i'm a favorite person and you don't even know it yet so today is tuesday tomorrow is a holiday so i want to go to junction i prefer the mr price at junction i find it well stocked compared to the two rivers one i'm going to get something if i get it i'll show you guys once I'm back home, I also want to pass by Kafo and then straight after that go to town and buy makeup brushes. I don't have enough so I keep washing my makeup brushes and I'm tired. I just need to have enough supply to not wash uh, every one to two weeks. I also want to get some cute earrings. I also want to get meat and what else and some other stuff that i'm sure i'll remember by the time i get to town so it's just basically to run errands so i want to submit the outfit of the day i'm not wearing any makeup i just powdered my face because ah, i don't have the energy so my cute bulb as usual is from five star beauty products it's at jamia mall shop number f50 you can get it for twelve thousand shillings and as for the outfit of the day I'm wearing this cute animal print blouse from Chica and jeans are from Chica as well. Shop number F114 at Jamia Mall and that is my bag of the day. My shoes are from Forever Trendy and yeah, that's the outfit of the day. For the scent of the day, I'm wearing Victoria's Secrets Bombshell which is almost over. And this is my shopping bag for the day. I need to give this to my mom because uh, she wanted it. Speaking of which, I'm actually going to town to also get uh, my mom curtains that I promised her. So yeah, that is the outfit of the day. Tuanze Safari Junction and then Dubois, aka Dubois. That's where you'll find cute earrings at a wholesale price. And that's also where you're likely to get the best brushes. So yeah, that's it. Let's head out and welcome, welcome to this week's vlogs. I hope you enjoy it. Just remembered I need to put my wings that are marinating in the fridge. So this is my sweater in case it gets cold because Nairobi weather is very shifty. And, and here are my wings that are marinating in this Ziploc bag that I'll make either today or tomorrow child. okay so let's head out now for real for real I am done with junction, it's around 3, so now let's head to town. Hey guys! I got home, and then standard procedure took off my hair, wig, and then remember they have to do a haul. So let's do a quick haul before I have my dinner. So the first uh, bag, which is this, has from, and I'm doing it standing because it's easier than when I'm seated and I keep adjusting my camera. So from Mr. Price, First item that I got was plastic ice cube thingy. This is uh, for my iced coffee. Sometimes I want iced coffee, but I don't have iced coffee. <laughs> so I got this so that I can keep my iced coffee here and have it whenever I want it. 
The next item that I got was this candle. It smells amazing. It's basil and neroli. 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 <laughs> Can't pronounce that second word, but mm, yes, it smells amazing. And last item I got from Mr. Price was this. This was actually what I was going to get. I want to exchange um, the centerpiece on my living room and instead have this one. This one went for 5,000 shillings and I hope it looks cute on my coffee table. So yeah, that was this was basically what I wanted to get at Mr. Price. And then I passed by Kafo at Kafo. I got these donuts. These are my favorite donuts from Kafo. I can eat four or five in one sitting because that's how much I love them. And these ones go for like 250 shillings. The specific ones were 234. I stocked up my samosas for breakfast. What is this? Oh, I got apples. I got um, plantain, two mugs that look like this. I love buying mugs from Kafo because they're usually beautiful. And I got some for my sister as well. So mugs, mugs. So I got three of these and I got one that looks like this. It says, all you need is love and coffee. Oh, and I got uh, sweet potatoes. I've been craving washes, so these are sweet potatoes. And that's all the stuff I got at Junction. And then I passed by town. I went straight to Dubois, aka Dubois Road, and I thrifted this cute robe. My skin is usually very sensitive, so I can't try on uh, thrifted clothes unless I have washed them. So this is a pink and white robe, and it's cute. So I got that for, I think, 500 shillings. in Jaribuku again, but wasn't successful. And then I passed by, passed by this specific shop that I've been shopping at since I think I was a student. It's at Dubois Junction Stalls, shop number B2. The name of the lady, she's very gracious, is Faith, and she recognized me from YouTube. I leave her number here. And please promote her whenever you're at Dubois, Dubois. She sells amazing stuff. So the first item that I got was this powder brush. Whew, I had to pick a call. So I got this uh, powder brush and I like buying brushes from Dubois, Dubois, because I think they have some of the most amazing quality brushes, honestly. I know what people say about Dubois, but this is a powder brush. And the other thing that I got from that same shop was a foundation brush, which is this. I think I'll need to wash that because it's not very clean and it's firm. Just the way I like my foundation brushes. And then I got uh, Kaflon earrings for my piercings because I've not been wearing it for the past two weeks. And then I got, what did they say this brush was for? I think it's a contour brush, but... But of course, I'm sure I'll use it in one way or another. So that was the stuff I got from that shop. And uh, I also passed by a neighboring shop and I got these cute gold earrings. They look like that. And then the owner of this shop was gracious enough to gift me some sunglasses. I had to pick another call sorry so these are the sunglasses that the lady gifted me and they are cute mm. so these and she also gifted me uh this this is lip balm baby lips lip balm ooh, ooh, ooh. the scent is amazing so yeah so she gave me these two gifts and if you're within Dubois, please visit her shop i'll link her number in the comment section 
and promote her because I think she's doing an amazing job. And then I passed by other stores at uh, Duboa. And I got more brushes. This is a set. A set was going for 1500. I usually prefer this because I know the quality is top notch. So yeah, it's a set of like 18 brushes from makeup powder to eyebrows, eyeshadow, everything. I have a similar set, so I just added one more and I think I have enough brushes now. So I want to be washing my makeup brushes all the time. I can interchange with uh, these others. And then still at uh, Duboa, I got these two pairs of earrings. That one over there and this pinkish one. This is very cute. I think this went for 150, this one went for 100 and this one went for 150. So yeah, that was the stuff that I got at Dubois. And then dinner because I do not think I have enough energy to prepare the wings that I was marinating. So I think we'll make those tomorrow. But I got extra meat from City Market. I was toying with the idea of getting perfume, but <laughs> the grace was sufficient. I did not buy perfume. So yeah, that was the stuff that I got uh, at Junction and in town. And I want to chill now because I'm super, super exhausted as I have my dinner with a cup of coffee. And I'll see you guys tomorrow which is a holiday so see you guys tomorrow good morning today is wednesday and it's our mashuja day so we're just home vibing driving and i'm about to make breakfast and then sit on the couch netflix and chill the whole day i want to watch uh Love is Blind. Is it Brazil? Yeah, Brazil. That's the one I'm currently watching. So yeah, breakfast first. So first up, I'm going to prepare my iced coffee for days to come. And that is breakfast for today, donuts and white coffee. It's time to make the sticky wings for dinner. I think they've been marinating for the past 24 hours. And that is going to be my dinner for today. So let me make it real quick and I'll show you guys the end result. So I'm done coating my wings in all-purpose flour. The next step is to deep fry them and then make the sauce to achieve the sticky wings. What the? What? 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 So there goes the sticky chicken wings. I have garnished one half with sesame seeds. The other half with chives and if you're curious to try out this recipe i have filmed it before scroll down to i think i captioned it sticky chicken wings and you'll find the full recipe there so this is what i'm going to have for dinner with fries and if i don't talk to you guys again i'll see you guys tomorrow Hi, today's the day that I don't vlog because my cleaning lady comes and as always I don't want to distract her. 
So for breakfast, I had the wings that I made yesterday and then I got too lazy to cook. So I ordered, yep, all this mess is my food. So I ordered a sticky fiber with family fries and a salad. And that is my strawberry crusher milkshake. And that is what I'm going to have today for dinner as well. And I think lunch tomorrow. Also, good morning. We're about to make breakfast in this building. <laughs> I haven't showered yet, if you can't tell, but I want to have breakfast, work, then I'll take a shower around 11 because I might step out for work. So yeah, breakfast first. What I'm having is smokies, sweet potatoes, the kafo donuts that have me in a choco cha and vegetable samosas. And I'm having tea masala today. Today is a Friday, that's why energy is on a hundred cha. So yeah. guys so this robe that i got the other day turned out to be smaller than i expected but that's okay because we never have to step outside with robes they're just in-house garments so yeah i'm going to have breakfast as i work and then i've decided i'm going to try vlog as much as i can this month because next month will be very busy for me i can't even promise any type of consistency so what i'm trying to do is make up for November during this month and part of December and then uh, if you have any video suggestions that you want me to do leave them in the comment sections and I'll check them out as long as it's not house tours and I think I should also do a current favorites it's been a minute I think the last time I did one was when I just began my YouTube channel so I think I'm due for that so let me work as I have breakfast and we'll see if I have to, to step out for work. So yeah, that's how my day looks like. And I'll talk to you guys later on. Hi, it's now in the afternoon and I'm stepping out for work. I don't think I'll stay that long, so it's just go, do my professional diligence and then come back. And unfortunately, I can't take you guys because uh, breach of confidentiality and also it will be very unprofessional to vlog when I'm working. So I want to submit the outfit of the day as well as the scent of the day before I step out. Oh, this hair guys I'm not sure I'm not too sure but I'm wearing my cute earrings that I got the other day so for the outfit of the day I have to slant my camera like that because of lighting but uh, I'm wearing this blazer that I thrifted a while back top is from Kairetu's apparel jeans are from Chica and and those rubbers are from tags design it's at Ibrahim's mall shop number D1 they are perfect for the occasion that I'm going and that is my bag of the day my mirror is a bit dirty as for the scent of the day i'm wearing black opium which is that by isin laher so yeah let me go work i'll be back in a few Good morning. It's definitely the following day and there's no power. So my breakfast options are very limited. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have plantain and iced coffee and maybe a smoky. And then I'm going to have breakfast at my balcony. Someone asked for a balcony tour. Now that I'm willing to give and then come and fold these clothes over here. And then fold those clothes over there. They've been sitting there for a week. And this is my guest bedroom. <laughs> it is the store, literally. I only spread it when I have guests. So, 
So yeah, let's make breakfast. I'll have it at the balcony, but pia kuna jua, unona? Imagine that's the sun. So that's where I'm going to have breakfast as I give you the balcony tour. So this is going to be my breakfast for today, plantain, donut, smoky and iced coffee. I can't sit at the balcony because it's too sunny, but let me just give you the balcony tour. I've just remembered I have a hair appointment at 11 and there's no power, so I don't know how that's going to go, but I'm going to hope that uh, power will be back before 11. So for the balcony tour, so it's too sunny and here is my balcony. I can only remember the name of two plants here. I think this one is called a fig tree. I don't remember the name of that. And that carpet grass I got from Kafo. And then this is the plant that has like a ball of pink, purple and white flowers. That's my Monstera. More plants, more plants. And then this is my hammock. Looks like that because I took out the cushion covers to be washed. So I'm going to return that. More plants there. There's strawberry, a red flower, a white flower. I don't know the names, guys. And more plants over there. Then there's my lavender and more flowers. So that is all there is to the balcony tour. And I am done folding clothes. Thank God. That's literally the worst chore ever. That and spreading the bed and sufuri ogali. I hate those three with a passion. So fortunately enough, the lights are back. So my hair appointment is still on. So that's what I'm looking forward to because underneath this hair is a mess, honey. So mm -hmm. can't wait to get my hair done. And then I'll talk to you guys later on guys i know i know i'm such a joke i went with the intention of getting wig lines for my wig but to be honest i also thought of shaving i also thought of weaving i thought of so many things i was very undecided but i settled for these river locks braids i think that's what they're called yeah and i think i look cute and while i was there i also got a package from an order i made yesterday because I just go to a nearby salon. So from Matpala, that's their shop. It's called Matpala and my mirror is dirty. I'm sorry for that. I got this double breast blazer that I can't wait to style. It fits. The fitting is perfect and I'm in love with it. So yeah, that was what my Saturday looked like and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, I woke up and I decided to wear earrings and style my hair just to see how I look like but I need to make this bun farm so let's go make breakfast first. And this is my breakfast for today. I'm having lemon hibiscus tea, plantain, sweet potatoes, cocktail, vegetable, samosas, smokies. And yeah, that is what I'm going to have. I'm also defrosting this mbuzi here. I feel like having a uh, ugali with wet fry mbuzi. So that's what I'm going to make for dinner. Guys, by the way, I'm sorry for the background noise. Today is Sunday, which means Today is also rest day. The rest is at uh, 10. So what that means is I have to end this vlog here so that I can edit and watch the rest with no pressure. 
so yeah that is that thank you so much guys for tuning in and thank you for always supporting my channel i'm really really grateful and i'll catch you on the next one until then stay safe and be kind bye